Hello friends, it's time to learn Euclid's 5 postulates. Now all of you know that axioms and postulates are universal truths accepted by mathematicians. Today, postulates and axioms are used interchangeably. Postulate is a verb. For example, let us postulate means let us make some statement based on observed phenomena in the universe. Its validity is checked, then it is accepted as postulate. So now let's look at postulate 1. A straight line may be drawn from any one point to any another point. So this means that if there are two points, point A and point B, we can join these two points by drawing a straight line between them. From A, we can draw a straight line up to B, up to C, up to D. Means we can draw a straight line from any one point to any other point. Here are two teams standing opposite to each other. Notice that the straight path joining player A to player B is only one. And do remember you will get many more paths if you don't want to go straight. Understand? So now postulate 1 is very clear to you. Now what is postulate 2? A terminated line can be produced indefinitely. Nowadays terminated line is called line segment. So what does definition of a line segment say? It states that a line segment is basically part of a line between two endpoints. So here you can see that AB is a line segment which is part of the line L and according to the definition of a line this line L can be extended indefinitely in both the directions. So to put things into perspective we can deduce that line segment AB or the terminated line can be extended indefinitely in both the directions as it is part of the line L. Now postulate 3. It states that a circle can be drawn with any center and any radius. So you can see here that a circle is drawn with a given center and a radius. Now let's look at postulate 4. It states that all the right angles are equal. So now, all these right angles are equal to each other since they are all 90 degrees. So, Harsh, will you please repeat four postulates? We are going to study Euclid's postulates, which are noted in our textbooks, which are in different geometry books, and which we are studying at different levels and different standards. So, let's go to our postulates. Straight line may be drawn from any one point to any other point. So thank you for watching the video and we are going to continue with postulate 5 in the next video.